filter okay so medyo tapusin natin siya uh, punta tayo sa h1 so let's say for example ito yung gusto natin sort meron tayong data okay actually things nga pa pala dun sa isa nating um, um, ating kaibigan na nag-share po ng kanyang data ito po siya pwede daw nating uh, gamitin so ayan gamitin natin for sort and filter so First rule is that pwede natin siyang i-highlight yung buong range natin. Okay, and then go to sort and filter, custom sort. So let's say for example, ang gusto nating i-sort is yung Facebook page likes na pinakamataas. Okay, so tingnan natin siya. So sort by Facebook page likes and then largest is So, mapapansin mo, ito ni highest to lowest. Right? Pero what if kung gusto natin siya baguhin, like, um, according to state, and then yung city niya, for example, parang sunod-sunod. Okay, so try natin siya, ha? Again, highlight po. Actually, sabi ni Excel, no need na daw po siyang i-highlight kasi automatic madedetect siya. Pero... Uh, for best practice po, highlight nyo na lang po yung naman. And then, sort and filter, custom sort, and then delete natin to for example. Add level po natin. So again, ang target natin is state first, and then according, order by A to Z. Okay? And then again, mag-add tayo ng level by city naman, na ganun din A to Z rin. Okay? So, ito yung uh, first level natin, ito yung second level natin, and then click OK. So, mapapansin mo, sa Northern Territory, meron tayong isang city, Alice Spring, to data natin, and then sa New South Wales, ito na siya. South, and then Victoria, yan. So, there's a lot of things na magagawa po natin dito sa ating sort and filter, right? Um, yeah, so, yun lang. First, again, uh, kailangan mo lang i-highlight yung range. Okay? Sort and filter. And then, custom sort. And then, that's it. Apply yung level. 